Hello, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Burton the Duke Archibald, and I'm here today with Wolf Hawkins, and we're out in the grassy plains. Oh! Wolf Hawkins here. Last name Hawkins, first name Wolf, and now a part of a pound's breakfast. You know, I didn't really think we'd be out here today, dude. I didn't think so either. And after the heat that we took from the volcano and from the red desert, I sure hope that King Crambone has some better plan for today. Yeah, things are heating up. King Crambone is bringing some of his best nights. And it should be a good fight today. Hopefully we bring a good champion too. Somebody who's good him. Quickness is what's going to take for Virginia and Thacko. the second wave of Crambone's troops. It's going to be interesting to see how this shakes out. Looks like Crambone's troops are about a quarter way to the spot. Genie back Hold up the defense and stop them. Here come some more troops. These troops are looking stronger than the last. Hopefully they can make a difference. They're gonna have to be sharp. Three waves deep and more incoming. I hope they keep going. It doesn't look like there's much to stop them right now. Here's another wave of troops. Now, how do we think the Genie and Thacko are gonna react? Well, their magic is pretty devastating, but let's not forget those offensive towers. Those are just chewing up Crambo's troops. That's right. Number four. We're just getting started. About a quarter of the way down the path now. Just a little bit closer. another wave of troops. Now, how do we think the Genie and Thacko are going to react? Well, their magic is pretty devastating, but let's not forget those offensive towers. Those are just chewing up Crambo's troops. That's right. It's wave five. Five waves deep already? There it is, about a quarter of the way towards the five. They're going to have to get closer. They want to do any damage at all. Here come some more troops. These troops are looking stronger than the last. Hopefully they can make a difference. They're going to have to be sharp. Wait. I'm wondering if Crambone has a strategy or if he's just throwing bodies at Ginny and Thacko. I 
looks like he goes. It doesn't look like there's much to stop him right now. How can King Crambone overcome these unstoppable odds by Ginny and Thacker? He's just got to make sure that he keeps switching it up and don't throw the same combinations over and over again. Well said, Duke. Well said. Seven waves in. Cramone's army started to take some big hits. I hope they keep going. It doesn't look like there's much to stop them right now. Looks like we got a fresh platoon of knights here. Yeah, and I'm surprised to see some of them. Uh, there was a number of them in there that I thought were going to be free agents and traded to a different kingdom. Yeah, really testing those free agency waters. Let's see how they do. Wave 8, about halfway through Cranbone's troops for this duchy. I'm starting to get a little concerned. There it is, about quarter of the way towards the spine. We're going to get closer than we want to do any damage at all. How can King Crambone overcome these unstoppable odds by Ginny and Thacker? He's just got to make sure that he keeps switching it up and don't throw the same combinations over and over again. Well said, Duke. Well said. Wave number nine. It's been a tough battle. Let's see if they can keep it up. Looks like the troops are about a quarter of the way there. To be honest, I'm surprised they made it that far. We're getting into the 10th wave now. Crambone's army taking blow after blow. About a 
quarter of the way down the path now. Just a little bit closer. Another wave of troops. Now, how do we think the Genie and Thacko are gonna react? Well, their magic is pretty devastating, but let's not forget those offensive towers. Those are just chewing up Krampus' troops. That's right. On the eleventh play, I feel like we're close to the end here, Duke. About a quarter of the way down the path now. Just a little bit closer. He's sweet, sweet. Looks like there's a new platoon of troops coming in here. Let's see if they can make a difference in the field. They're gonna have to. Well, if this keeps up, the champ will have to take care of this one. I hope they keep going. It doesn't look like there's much to stop them right now. On another wave of Crambone's troops. Clean slate for Crambone's troops. I don't know if they're gonna be able to make it past those towers, though. Those are looking unstoppable. Let's see what adjustments they make. They're gonna have to change up the game plan somehow because Genie and Thacko are gonna be taking it to them. Yeah, they've been taking huge blows. Blow after blow after blow after blow after blow. It's been one hell of a battle. that dude. On the 14th way. It's looking a little lopsided. About a quarter of the way down the path now. Just a little bit closer.
He's just got to make sure that he keeps switching it up and don't throw the same combinations over and over again. Well said, Duke. Well said. Don't worry, the champion will take care of them. I hope they keep going! It doesn't look like there's much to stop me right now. Pretty devastating, but let's not forget those offensive towers. Those are just chewing up Krampo's troops. That's right. Champion, so quick, so fast, and paired with that agility. <laughs> Looks like she'll slip with her daggers, though. Hey, hey, hey! She's a champion. All right, King Crambo picked her for a reason. Just like he picked the molehill. What about? Well, the molehill is now just. Genie and Thacko just took out another one of Crambo's champions. Genie and Thacko, maybe more powerful than. Fantastic right now. I can't deny that. He dispatched Crambone's troops like they were nothing. The elf champion is down! That's two champions now that Genie and Thacko have defeated. And to be honest, Genie and Thacko take the championship. We're all pretty much going to be enslaved under Thacko's tyrannical rule. You're not wrong there, Luke. But hey, did you get there? Gee golly gosh exciting, Duke! Next, Genie and Thacko will be headed to the land of giants where they're going to have to face off against the giant champions. 